you know, it's it's a really strange uh, phenomenon that's happening right now is you have one of the most influential people of all time, Elon Musk, and then you have him create a platform which is, you know, deemed a free speech absolutist platform. And it may it feels like that for now. But, you know, who knows what will happen, especially now it's election season. But it's very rare that a person to be that influential to have an uncensored, unfiltered microphone. So when you look at Elon Musk and you see his tweets and, you know, you know, it's him, it's not a publicist. And he clearly doesn't have, uh, you know, a PC kind of approach or, you know, even like a, a corporate kind of approach, a business kind of approach. He just kind of tweets what he wants. He tweets memes. He trolls. But. It's undeniable that, you know, his tweets, whether it's something about Tesla, whether it's something about Bitcoin or Dogecoin, absolutely move markets, absolutely are an indicator for me. Uh, wh now, it sounds crazy. I don't make the rules. I don't make the rules. So if you're wondering what did Elon Musk tweet that, you know, I think, you know, potentially, I mean, guys, you know, it, it, this could be standard manipulation. This could be uh, shit from the jobs report data. And I'll break all that down to later. Um, but what could Elon Musk have tweeted that actually pumped Bitcoin? Well, let me show you. And it's crazy that, you know, we were just talking about this feels like almost every episode, but, uh, just then Elon Musk says the dollar will be worth nothing if the U S doesn't do something about its national debt. So, and then he, he actually replied to watcher guru and Elon said, just stating the obvious. So. The U.S. dollar will be worth nothing if the if the United States doesn't do something about its national debt. So what can it do about its national debt? Well, I'll let y'all <laughs> I'll let y'all answer that in the chat. If you want to try to guess what the United States can do about the national debt, um, because I hear a lot of different shit, y'all. I hear that, you know, it can actually be paid down quite easily. You know, I hear people say that it's impossible. It can never be paid back. And I hear people say that they'll just start a war and collapse the entire banking system before they ever pay the debt. So what is the truth? What is fiction? Well, <laughs> we're going to find out, I think, really soon, y'all. And is Bitcoin the answer to the United States debt? Well, yes and no. Um, in theory, it's like, well, what other plans do you have? Oh, you, you, you're going to, you're going to tax us more. Oh, gee whiz. What a, what a brilliant idea. Well, guess what? You could tax us literally everything. If the middle class could literally everything and it wouldn't put a, a snowball size dent into the, uh, into the national debt. So that's bullshit. 